Hey guys, welcome to the six month update of living with a supercar. You may remember from the first series that I did, I did a McDonald's roulette. It was, um, for you guys that haven't seen the video, basically what you do, you find a drive through a fast food drive through and um, order what the person in front has ordered. So you wait for a car to go and order, and then you pull in behind and just ask for exactly the same, a duplicate order. However, we did the McDonald's drive through and it was a bit of a fail really, because we got a spicy veg wrap, which was absolutely horrible on a Diet Coke. Um, so this time we're going to change it up a bit. Due to my new healthy living diet and gymming lifestyle, we had decided to uh, drive the extra mile, in fact the extra 19, 19 miles, we're going over to um, the Starbucks drive through near Heathrow. So um, a few things that you might want to know about my uh, relationship with Starbucks is I don't like tea, I don't like coffee, um, so I'm really hoping that the person in front either orders a hot chocolate or a water. Um, and bearing in mind that the menu for Starbucks is pretty much all teas and coffees and things around that nature. This one could get quite interesting, so we're on route now to Starbucks drive through to uh, have a little fun and play Starbucks roulette. I'm nervous. The last time I did this I just was completely... Uh, blind to everything and now I'm just nervous but there's no one there we're gonna just gonna turn up in this car and hang around I can't really hide in this car oh, so we've got Starbucks on the left and KFC on the right and they've both got drive through hang around, we'll wait, we'll wait for a drive through. Starbucks roulette update, we're sat in the car park trying to be as incognito as possible, right outside Starbucks, it's the only car park space that they've got, and um, we're waiting for someone to come in, no one's coming in yet, oh there's a British gas van, oh, they're parking up. So we're waiting for someone to go through the drive through and order. Whether we wait 10 minutes or an hour and 10 minutes, we will capture someone and then order what they're having. We've now been here over 45 minutes waiting for someone to come in the Starbucks drive through This originally was a very good idea, but now it's turning out to be a long wait. Not one car has gone into the drive through Lots of cars have parked up, gone, parked up again, um, coming back for coffee. Um, but I don't, we haven't even looked about KFC because we did want to target Starbucks and we've only just noticed that the car park has an hour and a half maximum stay so we're, we're, we've, we've halfway gone through our stay which um, customer car park only maybe we'll just go in and just ask for the last order even if it was in the store and just ask to duplicate it for our car maybe so we're abandoning our original plan and just going to order what the last person in the store ordered because they haven't had a car for the last 50 minutes. And the shopkeepers are already looking. Order here. The shop people are already just poking their head around the corner. Let's turn the car down. Oh yeah, um, is it possible to order what the person in front has ordered? Uh, no, it has ordered. Even in store? No. Um, okay. Oh, I don't know what I want then. I was just going to order what the car up front uh, wanted. The last, the last recent customer uh, did all inside order the pumpkin spice latte. We'll have that, please. Oh, what size is that? Same size as well, yeah? Say exactly the same. Anything else? That's it, thank you. Bye bye. Oh, me first. What was that they ordered? I don't even know. It sounded like a latte, so I'm not gonna like it. But I've gotta pay for it. This is the worst bit, paying for something you don't want. <laughs> Lucky there wasn't a massive order from one of the local offices that there was one PA that decided to get the whole office coffees and they just come back with 15 coffees. I think I ordered one drink. One drink.
I'll ask what it is when he comes and brings it over to me. Wonder what colour it's going to be. If this is a real fail, we'll just go to KFC and do a <laughs> KFC roulette. But it's only chicken and I like chicken. Hiya. Hiya. Bomb, give it spice latte, no cream? Or with cream? Uh, whatever you fancy. Oh, uh, skinny one, yeah? Okay. Is it skinny? I don't know. <laughs> She's asking me what I ordered. If you ask me if I wanted cream on a latte, I've ordered a latte. And then she wanted to ask whether it was skinny, and I was just like, I don't know. <laughs> this is just like the weirdest situation because the customer has no idea what's going on, and the shopkeeper knows. What, the shopkeeper? The customer assistant knows more than the customer about what they ordered. It sounds like a pumpkin, pumpkin latte. It's gonna come out orange. Happy Halloween! Hope he doesn't spit in here, just be like, ugh, oh, I hate these roulette things. <laughs> Wonder if I can go in the pay. Just rev it up whilst he's asking for the money. Sorry, I can't eat. Is it gonna be a hot drink or what? I'm quite nervous. Yeah. Thank you. You haven't paid yet, no? Oh. Yes, thank you. Could have not paid. He goes, dude. Oh, have you not paid yet? Because I gave him the money. What a fail. It stinks. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Smell it. So, where can we park to try this? It smells like a, um, a garden centre. <laughs> Let's open it up. Oh, that's what it looks like. It looks like someone's done a poo on whipped cream. No offence, Starbucks, but... It's gonna be... Oh, that stinks. I don't know what you do with lattes. You have to wait, you'll probably have to wait until it cools down. Let's go and park over there and continue with our hour and a half stay. <laughs> right, window up. Car off. Now for the worst bit of um, any, any roulette. The McDonald's one wasn't too bad, it was disgusting. Um, but. Oh God. I don't even like la I don't even like the coffee. <laughs> but is latte coffee or tea? Pump pumpkin, where's the receipt? Did I get a receipt? It was pumpkin spice something latte. Skinny latte, maybe. Oh, I don't even want it. It's gonna make me sick. Absolutely horrible. I don't like whatever this is. I don't like it. My eyes are watering. Ah, oh. oh. so there we go. I'm now not going to do another roulette today. I will do another roulette at some point. At some point, not Starbucks. <laughs> um, and I'm going to get something that I actually want. So. I'm going to leave the car here, throw this away, and um, stop the video. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the Starbucks roulette. Did you prefer Starbucks or McDonald's roulette? I think I preferred McDonald's. Um, yeah, we're going to do another roulette sometime soon for Living With A Supercar, the 12 month update. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Oh, I don't want this anywhere near my, it's gonna stick my car out now. Horrible.